See that? Well, that's all right. Next time we see you guys, we'll be in Ili Omna, either in the lodge or hopefully on the water, catching some fish. wake up call this morning. Eddie, Jack and I just got done with our Michigan Long Range Schools and uh, Eddie and I are heading to the airport. Actually Jack is too. He's back there somewhere. Um, Jack's going to drop us off. Eddie and I are heading back to Alaska. Get to go fishing with some friends and Jack is taking the 250 back to Tulsa. We're going to go catch some fish. Hey, you want one? Want one what? You want one? Pre-COVID vaccination, not no, but no. <laughs> We're in Alaska and already delayed uh, to, to fly down to Iliamna, but that is Alaska for you even during the spring, summertime. Uh, Eddie and I are walking to get some breakfast since we have an hour. And uh, one more stop after that, then to the airport and on to Iliamna. The first and second. Now we're ready. See that? Well, that's all right. So it is 11:25. Uh, we're gonna be loading up here in a few. They've got our luggage loaded, and next time we see you guys, we'll be in Ili Omna, either in the lodge or hopefully on the water, catching some fish. And if our ride in here is any indication what this week is going to be like, we are in for a blast. Just on the way in, we only flew at about 900 feet the entire time, and we saw beluga whales chasing salmon, we saw moose, we saw multiple icebergs, and now we're here, we're going to go get in the boat, and we're going to catch some fish.
I'm not this much taller than Eddie. I'm, I'm on a rock. <laughs> How long have we been here? Half, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes? Oh, uh, no, we've been here longer? A half hour, 45 minutes. Half hour? Yeah, so yeah. at the most, we've been here a half hour, 45 minutes. There's a guy in the background catching fish, his first uh, Alaska trip. And we're, I think, one fish away from a limit of 30 with, with six of us here. It's ridiculous. So anyway, I don't know what else we're supposed to do the rest of the day, but I guess we're going to find out here in just a little bit. Now we're watching bears. Oh, we're, yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we were here for five minutes and big old grizzly right across our, actually, brown bears with coastal, uh, walking down towards all the other anglers down there. They're still there, so I guess he didn't show himself. But anyway, yeah, awesome start for the day. So guess what? It's day two. We've got some typical Alaska weather. We've got some wind blowing. we got some rain going, but fish don't care because fish are already wet. So we're gonna catch some more salmon, get our second limit. So this is my kind of fishing and probably Eddie's too. Breakfast wasn't until 8.30. We didn't start fishing until around 10.30. Limit by noon, limit of salmon by noon. Get to go back, we get to eat again. And now we're gonna go out and I don't know, catch some pike, some trout, some grayling, lake trout, something. I don't know, but anyway, awesome day. Big as he is. Ah! <laughs> all right, so you know, we came out here, and before we got here, my dad was talking all this smack about oh, he's gonna catch this giant rainbow trout, blah blah. blah. You guys saw what he just caught. I mean, come on, what kind of fisherman is he? It's my turn, we're gonna catch the big trout. So here's the part they left out. Yeah, my, my grayling was like, like this big, he's a little bitty. But he's a whole lot bigger than the one that he caught. <laughs> right? No comment. Yeah, so the truth is, yeah, we're apparently better salmon fishermen than we are <laughs> trout fishermen. We didn't do so good. No. On to the next one. Yeah. <laughs> This is Jimmy's place, which is friends with our outfitter, Eric, and they caught all of these fish that you see today in, uh, in their, basically in their gill nets, and they hang them this way to dry them out a little bit, and then behind me, this is his smokehouse, and so they smoke all their salmon, and it feeds them all the way through the winter, so pretty dang cool to watch this process. Too bad of a view, huh? <laughs> so, here's what we've learned on day two. Eddie and I are pretty much better at catching salmon than we are at trout. <laughs> I caught one. Eddie, did you catch any trout today? No? <laughs> it, was, it was tough, man. I, I was totally asleep when I caught mine. I wasn't expecting it at all. But, 
man, what a great time we're having here. Just on day two, as a group, we've already caught 60 salmon, caught a couple of trout, and tomorrow we actually get to do a shore lunch, Alaska style. We'll show you what that's gonna be like tomorrow. Thank <laughs> you.